Welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time that you're here, I'd love to welcome you. If you are returning, shout out to you for definitely diving into everything else that I have to offer when it comes to resources. My name is Jahanira and what we're going to be highlighting today is LASIK surgery and I'm excited for this one. Before we do that, make sure that you like, comment, subscribe, and share and let everyone know we're talking about LASIK today. Before we get into the video, this video is brought to you by Cam Smith Trey Photography. Y'all, that was a tongue twister. I had to say it three times and I edited it out. With Cam Smith Trey Photography, you are getting boudoir shoots, baby shoots, newborn shoots, maternity shoots, events. At the moment, he is working on videography. If you guys need to get a video done for either a proposal or a wedding or an excitement that you have coming up, definitely make sure that you guys reach out to him. I am going to drop his information linked in the description and let him know that your girl Yaya sent you, you know, for a little doozy. But we're working on getting things on and popping on this side now back to our video so now my laser journey started back in 2015 and i went into dr email chin's office in new york and i sat down for a free consultation now what this consultation consisted of was checking my vision um finding out what type of vision i had and then letting me know what my um my vision will be at the end of the surgery now what i do want to add is that if you are starting your lasik surgery research right which is something that i kind of did kind of did not do um what i didn't do is that i didn't see what the actual procedure looks like so um what the physician assistant told me was that she had LASIK surgery done almost 10 years at the time she didn't have any issues and i was I, I was sold. <laughs> I was sold. Um, I remember uh, going on theme park trips and then going to the beach and then there's certain places where your glasses and that glare and if you don't get them tinted and this and it, it was just so much with glasses. Sometimes I would forget my glasses at home and then the whole day at school or work would cause a crazy migraine. I hated it. My vision was bad and I was farsighted. So when I met with Dr. Chin, he assured me that the procedure would be quick and easy. It wouldn't be complicated and that there are risks involved as with any procedure so for me what he did tell me is that there was a possibility that i might go blind right and that's with any eye procedure with any eye procedure that an eye doctor does or an eye specialist does um especially involving them having to burn <laughs> um your cornea with a laser you you can have some su substantial risk which is why I did do a little bit more research on LASIK surgery and all the different doctors that we have out here in New York. Now, um, with the process of LASIK surgery, you guys do get prepped. They do um, an appointment to schedule your eye visit and ensure that your eye is in perfect health. Any um, marks that you have on your eye, they will let you know of what is there before the surgery and if anything will happen afterwards, they will also um, make you aware of it. Now, on the day of my actual procedure, when I went into the office, I did go in with a team of people. So it is recommended that you bring a buddy. When I finished doing the surgery, I came out of surgery. I went to bake by Melissa's to get some cupcakes because it was right next door. Then I walked over to Chipotle <laughs> and definitely ate. And then I was on bed rest for about a week, um, maybe two, and I was back into work. Um, I had no issues whatsoever. So on the day of the procedure, they brought me in. They dilated my eyes um, by eye drops. So by the time it was time to do the procedure, we started with the right eye. I didn't feel anything. Uh, the procedure takes no more than 10 minutes. And within that time, you are smelling the laser burning your eye off. Um, it's a very invasive procedure however i personally do not recommend that you go look at what that looks like because honestly if i would have looked at that video of what the procedure looks like i probably wouldn't have done it <laughs> i'm gonna be honest i probably wouldn't have done it but 
overall i can see i do have 2020 vision um we are now five six years later i have no complaints whatsoever i haven't had to go back in the office in about maybe two years so what i was doing is i did follow what the doctor told me about using the eye drops so these are tears eye drops and depending on your human system right depending on your body you're going to try different eye drops to find the ones that work for you um what they recommended about the eye drops is that i continue to use the tears periodically so i don't get to the point where i actually need them so i hadn't been using these for about a year and I just bought a new pack last week because my migraines started getting really bad. My eyes were bothering me a lot more lately. And then I remembered, crap, the doctor told me to make sure that I use these. So I did um, purchase these. These are Sustain Ultra. And another thing that happened throughout my LASIK surgery is that I was wearing a lot of sunglasses. So for the first six months, what is recommended is that you wear sunglasses to protect your eyes while they are healing. I honestly recommend going on Amazon or going to your nearest Marshall or Target and picking up $5 or $10 sunglasses because you're going to get bored sometimes unless you choose to invest and these lovely Versace sunglasses that belong to my boyfriend. <laughs> Super excited for these because these um, are great on the eyes, are definitely recommended. So definitely stock up on your sunglasses prior to the surgery because that's definitely something that you will use for the rest of your life. Now, um, I do want to also add, I've had this surgery for about five, six years now, and honestly, I barely wear sunglasses. I only wear the sunglasses whenever I feel that, okay, my eyes have had too much sunlight and now we need sunglasses. And then another thing that um, my boyfriend recommended because I started complaining about me being on the computer a lot and me being on the phone a lot. So what I would have recommended, oh, and they're not here. We're gonna have to pause this. Where are they? The best and these lovely versace sunglasses that belong to my boyfriend <laughs> super excited for these because these um are great on the eyes are definitely recommended so definitely stock up on your sunglasses prior to the surgery because that's definitely something that you will use for the rest of your life now um i do want to also add i've had this surgery for about five six years now and honestly i barely wear sunglasses I only wear the sunglasses whenever I feel that, okay, my eyes have had too much sunlight and now we need sunglasses. And then another thing that um, my boyfriend recommended because I started complaining about me being on the computer a lot and me being on the phone a lot. So what I would have recommended, oh, and they're not here. We're gonna have to pause this. Where are they? Scene. <laughs> I'd love to give a shout out to Cam Smith, Trey Photography, and Pink Lockers. Both of both of them are our family business, which I'm very excited for. We just got a 360 booth, so you have Cam Smith, Trey providing you videography, photography, and now 360 display. In addition to our business, Pink Lockers, who provides online apparel for women now babies and excited to venture out into the crafts that I've done and a little bit of the 360 booth that we're tapping into so i'm very excited for those thank you guys so much for tapping into this video and let's get back to the show <laughs> The blue screen glasses help you help anyone when it comes to your cell phone devices, your tablet devices, or even your computer devices. So now what I'm transitioning into now is a remote position where I am going to be working from home. I am also a day trader, so I'm always on the computer, and these are great. So have um, blue screen sunglasses, which are amazing because we are outside a lot. And what I just came across are a protective screen for your phone for your tablet and devices that protect you from that blue screen so if you guys can just get that that would be great another thing that i did want to highlight throughout my process is that you might have migraines 
that's what I sometimes get crazy migraines if I don't use the eye drops if I don't get rest if I don't use the sunglasses so you do have to keep up with the process and make sure that you're taking care of your eyes as we're transferring into a digital era we're on computer screens we're on cell phone screens all of the time protecting your eyes is definitely something that you guys want to upkeep the reason for me doing this review and doing this video is because although I've had an amazing journey when it comes to my LASIK surgery, I also want to encourage my friends who wear glasses to definitely opt in to LASIK surgery. It's not per se something that you need to do. However, it does give you the flexibility of not having to worry about glasses, which is what I don't mind. I get to go to the theme parks and not have to worry about leaving my glasses on the side or someone stepping on them. When we invest in our glasses, we invest a lot of money, especially if you're like me. When my first pair of glasses that I got were Burberry frame, I got them tinted. It was, it was hooked up. I loved them up until I didn't love them anymore. And what I want to close off with is the different packages that they have. So without their email chain right now, they have a silver pack which is what I'm under the impression that I got because I paid $4,200 and it goes for $4,000. They also have an HD pack, which goes for $5,000. And if you connect with me and reach out to me or let them know that I referred you, then you get a discount off of your package and I also get a gift card as well. So it's, it's kind of like a paid partnership, but more of a referral base. And I enjoy talking about products and services that offer that referral based program. It's kind of like affiliate marketing where I tell you about it. If you think that it's a good choice for you, then you also go into the office with my name and that will also give you a discount. I love discounts. So I'm gonna leave the info down below. I'm also going to ensure that I tag you guys Dr. Emo's page so you guys can do a little bit more research on them. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Okay. What should we do? The sunglasses? Yeah, how it's Facing the other way. Gotcha.